The Green Bay Police Department is struggling with the loss of one of its canine officers, but one little boy is helping that department heal. Ethan Angam may have met his match. Green Bay canine officer George is a little stronger than the seven-year-old. Officer Derek Wickland says these days, the department is gaining strength through Ethan. It takes a long time to, for these dogs to learn the job and to figure out what we want to do with them. And, you know, that's what's so devastating about cops is what he was just getting to be the dog that we needed him to be. He was getting to be the, in the prime of his life. And obviously, you know, now he'll never reach that potential. It was sort of her that, that died to then. We were going to raise some money to get a new dog for them. Ethan started a GoFundMe page for the department. So far, he's donated $520 Thanks, bud. to help pay for a new dog. When he decided to do this, it was, uh, it was a pleasant surprise, you know, given the, the difficult time our unit's facing right now with the death of cops. It's nice when we get to do things like this with Ethan and his family. It kind of uh, rejuvenates you a little bit and makes you want to come to work again and see the good in people, not just the bad. So I feel good. Like helping them. Ethan's had a chance to bond with some of the canine officers here at the Green Bay Police Department, so much so he wants to be a canine handler when he grows up. I'd like to do it, chase the bad guys and then um, work with a drug sniffing dog. Yeah, you could see his passion and his enthusiasm and I think it was contagious. You know, I got roughly 14 years left and in 14 years I'll be 21. So maybe he'll be starting when I'm finishing and, you know, we can uh, work together for a few years or a month or so before, uh, before I call it quits. Seems that training is already underway.